Hey guys, Dan here. Uh, this is just going to be a quick uh, update video. Um, we've already hit September for 2017, and as the year comes to an end, I started thinking about some of the projects that I need to get done, along with plans for next year. Uh, earlier this month, I pre-ordered the Perfect Grade Millennium Falcon, which I pretty much decided was going to be my end-of-the-year project, so um, I believe it comes in end of October, which gives me about two months, give or take, to, uh, to finish it. And from there, I've pretty much decided um, 2018 is what I'm calling it. It's going to be the year of giants, and basically what that means is I have... Three perfect grades and uh, an MG Psycho Zaku in my backlog, and I don't want them in my backlog anymore. So basically, what's going to happen is I'm going to burn through all four of those kits in 2018 and build them all to completion. And I'm going to start with the perfect grade Banshee uh, come January, or really whenever I get done with the Falcon. And I'll probably break those kits up with some smaller projects. Uh, some high grades or maybe a real grade, just something to uh, kind of uh, break up the monotony of doing you know a bunch of perfect grades and other bunch of kits right in a row. Uh, a couple other things that are coming up. Um, I talked with uh, my buddy Saintism down in Australia, and he and I have decided to do a build off, which will be coming up kind of soonish. Um, since it's September and Australia is in the southern hemisphere, they're coming out of their winter season and into spring. And uh, obviously, in the northern hemisphere, we're exiting our summer uh, season and entering the fall. So basically, as soon as the weather improves for him, we're going to uh, start building. And we've each decided to take a different version of the high grade Barbado Skindum from IBO. And I'm going to be building the sixth version which is the version that I prefer. And he's probably going to build one of the Lupus versions. I'm not exactly sure yet, but it um, should be an interesting build. I have no idea what I'm going to do with mine yet, but probably incorporate some plot plating and some panel line scribing. If you're not familiar with Saintism's work, uh, definitely check the, uh, the link uh, in the description. He's an excellent builder and uh, really does some phenomenal shading work. Um, in addition to that, yesterday I selected the newest uh, free commission winner out of my patron group. Uh, from now on, basically, free commissions are only going to be given away to current patron members, and I'm going to do it completely randomly and without announcement, um, really with no clear pattern. So, I'm still waiting for him to get back to me with what kit he wants to have built. Um, it should be interesting regardless of what he picks. I always enjoy these. And, uh, oh yeah, I finished something. That would be the Master Grade Providence Gundam. Um, it's finally done. Um, I'm going to be completely honest. Um, I only bought this kit because it came with a big-ass sheet of decals. But um, I'm really glad I actually built it. Uh, kind of has the same design principle as the Freedom 2.0, tons of detail, um, just a really nice sculpt, very aggressive looking. Um, and yeah, it was, uh, I wouldn't say it was exactly fun, but it was a, it was a good build. A um, little repetitive with all the fin funnels, but hey, you know, take what you can get. Um, that's, that's kind of it right now. Uh, I was working on a high grade, uh, Nobel conversion that I was, I've kind of been working on since last year and got most of the way through it and wasn't satisfied with some stuff. So now I'm waiting on some new parts to come in. So that's also on the back burner. We have a high grade Zaku F2 that I'm also working on. I think we're going to do a Tristars theme on that. And this Friday, uh, September... 8th um, at uh, Waltz Hobby Town in Syracuse we're going to be hosting a Gundam build night so if you happen to be in the greater central New York area uh, Rochester, Utica, Ithaca, Binghamton um, any of the little smaller outlying towns you know make the drive up I think it starts at 730 I have the announcement on um 
my patron Twitter and a couple other things. Uh, should have a pretty good group. Uh, bring your kits, bring your tools, and uh, yeah, hopefully we'll see some of you there. All right, guys. Thanks for checking out the video. See you around.